take off my fresh kicks. All right, so I cleared security. I had to go through the peasant line because I don't have Nexus. My, my mom and my brother do have Nexus, so they left me behind. Embarrassing. But uh, I should probably put my phone camera away. I don't know if I'm allowed to record in here. All aboard, here is our plane heading to Vegas. So we'll, we arrive in about two and a half hours, so it's a really short flight. I'll see you guys in Vegas. Thank you. First thing you see when you get off the plane, slot machines in the airport. That's the first. We got our stuff and we're gonna go pick up our car. So I just checked my phone after getting off the plane and I got an email from Royal Caribbean Cruises and so they actually invited me to go on a cruise in the next two months. I'm fully booked for the next two months so obviously it's not a possibility but Pretty exciting stuff, and I'm definitely opening the conversation to future collaborations. Yeah, who would say no to a cruise? All right, we got our rental car for the week. What's it called? <laughs> Enough said, call in. This is where you come with your private jet, I guess. I mean, you don't have time for the airport. Standing in front of it, right? Get a picture. caliber while eating some burgers. So in Vegas it's totally legal to drink on the street and so you can help yourself to what looks like, honestly I have no idea what this looks like, a fancy way of drinking. So we've checked into our place here and we're staying at a place called Club du Soleil. Sounds really cheesy but it's actually pretty nice. Uh, we have two bedrooms so staying in there with my little brother, how cozy. This is my mom's room, there's two bathrooms. You get the point, it's pretty good. Uh, we're gonna go get some groceries because we're here for a week and yeah. Going to Albertsons to get some groceries. It's got your essential nutrients for the day, cheese balls. So unlike in Canada, in the US, they sell beer in the grocery store, which is actually so convenient. In Canada, you have to go to a liquor store to get liquor, because they actually separate them. It's illegal for any business to sell alcohol other than a dedicated liquor store and bars and restaurants, obviously. But uh, it's pretty unfortunate and makes life a little bit harder. I literally lost my mom in the grocery store and I can hear her yelling my name. Mom? <laughs> mom, where are you? So we're inside the Mirage and right behind the concierge there's a massive fish tank and that's a small fish tank compared to their bigger one. Slots on slots on slots on roulette on roulette. I guess it's a volcano that goes off. I was like wow everyone's pretty easily entertained these days. <laughs> Like a city of lights. Everyone was waiting for a giant volcano to go off, but it's too windy, so it never went off. And yeah, people were very disappointed. There's still like hundreds of people waiting along all the waterfall, waiting for that thing to. It's supposed to be a volcano, but like I said, those red lights mean it's way too windy to blow the fire because I guess it would light stuff on fire. So, safety hazard cannot be used. Treasure Island and I guess every now and again they have a show here and I don't really know I'm sure we'll see it at some point we're here for seven days
We're continuing our tour of Vegas, and this is the entrance to the wind. Looks very high end. Oh yeah, this is yeah, I like the wind. beautiful. Now you can pay $20,000 to have basically a refurbished Nokia. This one has alligator leather on the bottom of it. Eat your spinach. Liam, get on it. New profile picture. Oh wow, they're flowers. Hotel of the tour for today. We're going inside the Palazzo. Very cool. So, this is the iconic canal that runs through the Palazzo. And you can actually get on these little gondolas and they'll give you a ride. It's actually pretty convincing. So, it's like nighttime outside, but I feel like it's daytime. That looks so good. It's like a kebab with chocolate and fruits. This is huge. Yes. We just had a really delicious Italian meal and I'm stuffed. We got spaghetti and meatballs and we got a ton of bread. I'm so, so full. Um, we're going back to our place now and that will be the end of the night. Tomorrow, we're gonna go on a hike somewhere and I think we're either gonna go to the Hoover Dam or maybe the Grand Canyon. But I think we'll do the Grand Canyon later. So, you will see. I'll keep you guys on your toes and I won't even tell you what we're gonna do until tomorrow. So we just went into the Mirage and inside the Mirage is the One Oak Club which is like a really well-known club and I actually went and talked to the manager and asked him if I could come and check it out tomorrow so he said he'll take care of me. Now I just need to find someone to go to the club with because I don't really want to go alone. So I'm going to figure out how to find a club friend for tomorrow. And also I was standing just inside the Mirage and I heard a guy on his phone he's like, yeah man I just saw Khloe Kardashian with her her hands were just crossed, she was just sitting outside. I'm like blah blah blah. And I guess yeah, Chloe's here for like a, a fan signing, I don't know. So she's coming back in, but we're leaving now. Cool. My barber's on point. Yeah, she looks really good. Here, can I show them? Yeah. 